at the later stages you were carrying. Ah. All right, so this is what we're going to play with right here. Casual buffs, crit buff, uh, horse buff um, on Arsha. Hopefully no one intervened. Yeah, uh, Vicious Shadow, uh, back attack, back attack. Mm, more, more back attack. We, we don't need down attack. Um, uh, back attack. Uh, skill add-ons right there. I think that's everything. Uh, pop the pets. Get to get the loot. 235. Maybe we can crank it up a little bit for funsies. 300. Agris. Okay, let's go. You won five matches in a row? Damn. Yeah, that's that's nice. I I've been winning and losing like every other game. So I, I don't really know. It it doesn't really feel too good, to be honest. What are we touching? We are we touching pixels. Many, many, many pixels. We uh, we're gonna do a little bit of recording today. Um, so someone told me that my twenty three point six k at uh, Tungrad Ruvens uh, sucks. So I was like, okay, all right. <laughs> so yeah, now now we gotta start recording again. We we're gonna record many places. Yeah, yeah, it's a totally garbage, totally garbage hour in in Tangred Ruins. I I can't cannot believe myself. How you doing, Moody? Nugget woke you up at six a.m. for cuddles. Oh, wait, is that is that a cat N Nugget? You basically agreed. I mean, to to a certain extent, like you can you can throw away so many comments to to a certain extent, but like even if even if it's the most stupidest comments ever, some of them are gonna go through anyway. You know, it's just a matter of time. It, it can be it can be very shitty comments, like you know, oh, you have a silly face or whatever. Uh, usually I would be like, yeah, true, but but then, you know, the one one in a thousand, it'd be like, well, I do actually have a silly face, so what the fuck? Y you know? <laughs> Is the kitten? Oh. Did, did you fall asleep after? I mean the the thing is uh, the thing is that this is just based on RNG. Like, like if if I want to get more than twenty one twenty two thousand, this is just based on RNG. So like if if I get like twenty two point five or above, it's it's just I'm I'm being a little bit more lucky. Like like a little bit more luckier side of things, you know. If if I get like twenty four thousand. That that's like massively lucky, massively lucky. You you shouldn't be that lucky. If you get more than that, I I guess you're hacking at the same time. <laughs> you're hacking. Avdox, thank you for the follow. Thank you, thank you. Welcome. You returned to BDO two days ago, and thank you for the YouTube guides. Well, thank you, thank you for watching them. Thank you for the support. 
I, I appreciate that. How, how do you enjoy BDO? I hope you'll be getting twice the amount if you are hacking. Now only, only a little bit, so people are unsure. It, it'd be too obvious otherwise. Yeah, well, what are you up to, Moody? Uh, except for dying. That that wasn't a wasn't a good enough answer. Video is so different now. You have a dream horse. What the fuck? Yeah, you you get a dream horse. You you get a free pen black star, a free tet black star, a free dream horse. You you get an. You get an accessory hammer for free that you can sell for like uh, 28 billion. Um, yeah, well, what else do you get for free? I mean, that, that's, that's just the tip of the, uh, the tip of the mountain. <clears throat> but yeah, hopefully you can have some fun with those items. So yeah, we, we're doing a little bit of a recording here to just see how lucky we can get, I guess. I probably should have run a, another rotation right there, but... You created a seasonal visa. Your guide helped me a lot. Uh, content creators, two guides who so organized like you. Well, thank you, thank you. Um, I think I should mention that uh, you're a teacher, content creator for free D art, uh, so I know what it takes to make guides. Uh, well, thank you, thank you so much. Yeah, I mean, it's, it is a lot of work. It, it is a lot of work. M most most of the other content creators they don't put the time in. They they can they can do great guides too, but they don't they don't put the time in, and that, that's kind of kind of what it is. So you just gotta gotta put the time in. <clears throat> but I've been I've been working with uh, creative arts um, for for a long time. So it, it does come, it comes a little bit easy to me to like learn by myself and yeah, it's the, I, I definitely have the interest for it too and the passion. So it is, it's kind of easy, but uh, it, it does take a long time though. And it, especially if you're already doing streaming, like streaming eight hours a day and then you, you go and make like a guide on the side or something like that, you know. <laughs> Is some pretty long hours in in a daily basis, but yeah, I I really appreciate it that you uh, that you guys like the things that we do because um, otherwise I wouldn't do it. I I would I wouldn't even be um, there'd be no reason for me to to put the extra time in. Hey, what's up, Caleb? How you doing, buddy? Oh.
<clears throat> but yes, as a content creator, like I, I want to get that information out there many times, you know, we, whatever it could be like guides or grind videos or like, yeah. And, and sometimes even doing, doing interesting, fun videos too. Is shilling because uh, migraine? Oh no. Can can you do something about that? That was the main LAN where she came out. Uh, it was hard to get uh, to 60 back then. And uh, now we've been watching videos figure out uh, where we change LAN or stay visa. You, you can play both. I I used to play both one time and it, it was two of the best classes that I ever played, like an enjoyment wise. So I, I used to run around um, on, on the LAN and uh, VUSA as, as a double PVE tag. So I, I thought it was definitely worth it. Um, it. It was very fun to play. You took a pill? Oh no. Yeah, drink uh, drink some water, lay down, r rub your head. Oh, like, like a cold blanket on the head? Mm. Hello, D-boy. How's it going, buddy? I don't have enough gear to do this, so I are sad. I, you need to get grinding. You need to, you need to do more grinding. How is LAN in Node Wars? Capped? Uh, capped Node Wars is better than uncapped. But uh, but it's not like a meta class or anything. Uh, succession LAN is a little bit better than the Awakening LAN in capped. Even even in uncapped. You can, you can play both of them, to be honest. You can play the Awakening LAN, you can play the Succession LAN in like EC tier 1 or something. But the uh, the more gear that you know the the more gear that the cap is the uh, the more you're gonna suffer. So I I guess I guess it's the strongest at uh, tier one easy. But yeah, like you you can play it. It can be good. You know you can ki get a few kills. Um, but but it's not a meta class. So if you fight meta classes, uh, you're probably gonna suffer a little bit. But if you if you don't fight meta classes, you you have a fair chance, right? So it it depends a little bit. That uh, that's the uh, that's the experience that I got so far, um, and and how I remember stuff. And it, it should just be all the same because if if anything, they only nerfed the LAN, so like it it hasn't really become better. If if anything, it only became worse, especially the higher the cap is. Uh, what are the meta classes? Uh, different meta classes on different channels, like different servers. But but on on EU is like Serker and Dracania. Uh, Wizard is is uh, another you know Node War class that people need to play with. Um. Yeah, I, I guess the Serker and Rakania meta is the same on NA as well. It, it should be. They, they are literally unkillable. Uh, luckily you have 8 hours before the raid. Yeah, yeah, you can get, get some rest before the raiding. You, you don't need to shot call, right? Or do you do you do any kind of shot calling, Caleb?
you won't even join the call. It's an old ultimate. You know your stuff. Yeah, okay, that's good. That is good. That That's what I do in AOS. AOS is the um, free versus free PvP ranked uh, games. I, I don't I don't join the calls because people just have bad ideas. It's better if I just play the way that I used to play and... Yeah, I, I know what to do. Yeah, if someone someone giving me bad ideas, that that's a that's a fast way to lose the game for sure. <clears throat> uh, there will be a lot of clutter in uh, voice chat this uh, casual group uh, just uh, helping to fill the absent people yeah yeah that's good that's nice you, you get loot though you, you have to get loot right you gotta do it for the loot Oh my god. Yeah. Yeah, yesterday we got raided by biceps. So that that was very nice a uh, biceps. Uh, pretty pretty amazing. So in the in the month now that we've been streaming, it's like one of the best months uh, ever that that we've been streaming, and and we keep on doing that. Like usually every other month now, we uh, we keep on doing better and better. So like every every other month is like usually the best month that we that we ever streamed. <laughs> and and this month we uh, we up to like ninety two people on average, and that that's pretty poggers. 90, 92 people. Uh, but yeah, when it comes to when it comes to the amount that we pull in um, ourselves, that that is uh, sixty eight. So we we still need to get seven more. We we need to get seven more so we can apply for Twitch partner. Uh, so that that's the idea at least. So yeah, pretty pretty close, and I I do appreciate you guys hanging out. Big big support. Great support. Oh, get the loot. And there'll be yeah. Um, it's just a progression group. Uh, you helping with uh, phase two out of seven? If you want loot, you can make a group and clear it in 20 minutes. Oh, okay. So you're just being nice. You're just being nice. We uh, we might have that um, soon because we we're doing like a special a special streaming week pretty soon, so we we might have that when we just boosting people. Like like for for an entire day, we just boost people for an hour, like but for like ten twelve twelve hours of uh, you know Gaifen. So we we can do that kind of like charity community charity stream. <laughs> yeah, we can we can do that.
Um, you can clear this ultimate with one AFK player, which is actually a challenging thing. God damn. Solo. Oh no, like you like one one less player. Hmm. Interesting. What what do you uh, what do you think about the news of uh, Doctor Disrespect, uh, Caleb? You do it for free, but some people actually pay to get boosted this way. Yeah, I mean, for sure, for sure. That that's always been a thing. People people try to pay to uh, to get either like gold or progression, or to get some kind of a boost, like like to leech or. Yeah, that's been a common thing for for a long time. In in Rose Online, that that was a that was another MMO that I played for like fourteen years. I I I was a crafter, right? I I had many different characters, but like one of the mains was, was like a crafter, and I I used to I used to like take pay to to like make people things, and uh, not not like IRL money, but uh, you know in game uh, silver in game items. Because there, there were so many people, because I, I was like one of the best ones on the server, right? So there, there were so many people that needed shit to be crafted, right? And and I was like, I don't, I don't have time to even play the game. Like, <laughs> you you would have to give me stuff in the game, you know? Like, yeah, some some people are pretty crazy, you know? They they gave some pretty expensive items. Like, so yeah, I I became I became rich very quickly. Call them PayPal legends. Oh, <laughs> PayPal legends. Currently, free ultimates out of five can be done with uh, seven people. Uh, but uh, but that's like seven seven sweaty people, right? It's not like seven uh, semi casual. Yeah, this uh, this is a good event right here. We we need like three of these, and we can go above uh, twenty two point five. So if if we get like three of these uh, big events, uh, and uh, that's the idea. The the idea is to get lucky now and and to make a recording. <laughs> put put it in the title. Put it in the title. I, I don't want it to be like super lucky though, but but like a little bit lucky. That that would be that would be cool. But yeah, I'm I'm gonna write. Uh, obviously, I'm gonna write about that if if we do get lucky. So we we don't like scam anyone. Uh, sweaty, yeah, because some mechanics uh, play out differently. When you miss one person, it adds random factor into the fight. Ah, intro, okay. 
So so it's it's like a different raid in a way. And DPS is not an issue in old ultimate, so you skip uh, less uh, boss HP uh, scripted mechanic. Yes, give me loot. Give me all of that loot. Okay, that was a good event. Come on, baby, give me more. Give me more loot, big loot, big loot. Two more events, that would be cool. We can, uh, we can definitely do it. Uh, because, for example, in uh, most Final Fantasy content, there's like uh, boss hit 75%, uh, and the script happens, some mechanics happens in certain timestamps. Uh, but when you when you do a lot of DPS, the mechanics just doesn't exist. Oh, it's like you you break in the mechanics. Yeah, we we know about that. We we know about that in BDO. <laughs> we know about that in BDO. They they buff the classes so hard that that uh, you know. We, we kind of skip the mechanics now because people do so much damage. Yeah, we, we know about that, yeah. Oh, Limbo Key. Don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do. I'll, I'll take that. Oh, that's a bad... Um... Yeah, very puggers. Super pug. Uh, have you guys seen the new emote? The, the golden boy? The golden boy we have skip implemented in our uh, official strat. Mm. Yeah, it's to clear it faster. I mean, it's, it's the same thing. If you if you want to be like rank one or whatever, like on a ladder, you you gotta skip the mechanics. That there is no way around it. I use potion at this and that time, uh, hold the buff burst uh, for this and that time, yeah. Coordinated uh, gameplay. The uh, the only time when I did that was when, uh, when we were doing uh, PvP, and, and back in the days we were doing PvP so competitively in BDO and I I was like the one of the leaders in in the flank uh, flex team, so we we had to coordinate like the um, had to coordinate like uh, popping uh, elixirs and stuff like that, and it it wasn't like a common like nowadays is a common thing. Everyone is using elixirs like, but but back in those days you had to like coordinate it. Um, 
you, you definitely didn't want to waste on those, like. Actually, sometimes no skip wipe because people just doesn't know the mechanics. Mm. Even for this uh, corporation, I don't need voice chat. I just remember. Yeah, I mean, you you have it in your bones, so it, it makes sense. I'm gonna try to skip on that bus right there and see if it still exists when I got when when I get back. It's the first time I tried this, so it, it could could uh, backfire a little bit. Oh. Nice, pen debo. Oh, nice, nice is still here. Oh, I didn't even need to kill like the, the small guys. So actually, actually pretty nice. Wait, what? This group I helped today are all my long-term friends, so you will roast them if no skips? Oh, yeah. <laughs> you suck. Oh, no. Okay, we, we're doing... Gr okay. We, we're doing crazy loot right here. Can't, can't even use my maids. That, that's pretty crazy. Crazy. One of them is playing your main class in the raid, so I will be memeing. <laughs> Toxic. As, as long as they have a good spirit. But yeah, hopefully, uh, hopefully a lot of people want to join in on the special streaming week, and we can uh, we can do some pretty long streams, um, you know, from from morning into uh, like almost nighttime. 
it, it depends a little bit on how how burnt out I'm going to be, but we we definitely have a, a lot of like we we have a lot of streaming time. Um, it's like if if we get big raids and stuff like that, I'm I'm just gonna try to push it as long as I can, right? I I wouldn't usually be able to do that. I can do like one or two hours uh, longer, but. Could could be very nice. We we try to do something fun, maybe like color my hair again or something. You won't be caster for once. You bringing a gun to the fight? Ooh. Yeah, that's what you wanna do. We'll see if this can be a record hour um, right here. I think I think it could. It has the potential to be one. Usually I'd be a little bit like, usually I get like a little bit unlucky when I do recordings. And I, I don't know why. Uh, but like usually that can happen. I mean, usually it happens. Rafa Lotterman, thank you for the follow. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You dyed your hair too? Well, you did? Well, what color? The, the last time we dyed the hair, um, I, I was golden boy, right? We, we usually make like a emote out of it. Yeah, la last time we were the golden boy. Uh, this time around, I I don't really know. We we could uh, we could end up with like some pink or something or. Um, I I don't I I don't know I don't understand that English English only, or or Swedish. Uh, por qué? <laughs> por qué? Oh, ginger? Oh, really? That's a, that's a ballsy color. I, I thought I thought you were gonna say like black or something. I mean, I, I don't really have that much hair right now because I just cut my hair, but I mean, maybe that was a bad timing. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it, it is nice to, to swap it up a little bit. We we also have to buy a new hat because like every every time we do like a bonus stream on Saturdays, um, it, it has to be Hatter Day, right? So every every Hatter Day, I want to have a new hat on. So we we have to buy new hats. Come on, what spawn spawn events, please?
You just cut your hair bald style. Mm. Yeah, I'm, I'm I'm pretty close to doing the same thing. I have a few millimeters when I when I trim it, right? But it's it's also because of the uh, I I have a thing like an autoimmune disease, right? That that they call like alpecia areata or something. And and what what happens is like I I, I lost a little bit of my hair. Like you know, like like almost like a centimeter in diameter, you know, like I I just lost uh, a little bit of hair on my on on my head, right? So I've been I've been cutting it a little bit shorter, you just to like kind of fade it in a little bit. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, it it does suck. It it does suck. It's annoying, but uh, to be real, like to be real, like it doesn't really affect me too much. But but it is annoying. Uh, I I don't have it like the bad way. I I just have one spot. It's just one spot on my head. But yeah, you can you can get like more spots. You know that would be even worse. Uh, so hopefully hopefully that doesn't happen. Hey Faffy, how's it going, buddy? I mean I'm I'm trying to be a good spirits about it. You know may, maybe it grows back again. We we don't know. Uh, you don't have a patient to comb or to get nice hair. All my patient is being uh, drained on BDO grind. Ah, uh, yeah. I mean, that's, that's a quick way to lose your hair in, in the BDO grind. <laughs> I guess you're stuck with a new hell. 18 out of 20 Pandeba rings. Oh, god damn. Yeah, that's not fun. Uh, that sucks. Hopefully, hopefully you get it next, and and then you one shot the next one. To to compensate. Finding a cause of it sucks. Yeah, I mean, it's it's most likely stress to be honest, because I I don't we we don't have that in the family. We we never had that in the family, so it, it's not genetic. So the the second reason for it could be like stress. I I eat very good. I exercise. Like I move a little bit. You know, like yeah. Is the the only thing that I know is stress, and I I can be very stressed uh, many times. Uh, it's because I like to do things, and I I usually do things a little bit too much. But yeah, like 80% chance it's gonna grow out in the first year, like... Or, or, or what is it, 90% or something? 80, 90, I don't know. But yeah, some, some people have to wait a few years before it can grow back, and, and sometimes it doesn't. But yeah, it, it, it'd be way worse if, uh, if like the entire head was like filled with, uh, you know, bald spots. I, I would have to like shave the head. Uh, entirely. Does it just fall? Uh, we fall your, we fall your head, or does it hurt your body? Uh, no, it it just it just stops growing. So the the auto autoimmune disease it it just makes it so it stops grows. Like like it just stop stop growing, in in a spot, you know, like in a spot. It's kind of weird, but uh, yeah. It's you know like the is is a fascinating thing at the same time because like it's it's like programming in a way. It's like your DNA just tells you like yeah no no we we don't need to grow at this at this spot right here like <laughs> it's like what the fuck video enhancement system is no good for you ah keep keep on hammering you, you're gonna get it Faffy you're you're so close but yeah it's, it's a very painful journey with um, enhancing uh, a, a few of the items uh, sometimes 
I, I'm personally down 180 billion trying to make a Tet Debo. So that, that's why I haven't really got that much money in the last uh, you know couple of months. I, I still make uh, profit, but, but I should have had 180 billion more. Um, well, what that means is like al almost five Tet Debarakas that I should have been made, but I, I just never made one. So kind kind of very unlucky. If if the average is like five Tet uh, Debos, I I got zero. <laughs> so yeah, that's that's like super unlucky. Oh nice, we got the event. Nice, nice, nice. Bring me record hour grind. Come on, baby. If you want to get bald, go raid to Final Fantasy with randoms. Yeah, that doesn't doesn't sound that much fun, no. Ah, oh, that was a short event. God damn it. Yeah, but I, I think it's because of streaming. I think it's because like we, we do so much work. Um, I, I think that's the reason why I'm so stressed uh, many times because I, I, do, I do like 12 hours a day uh, streaming stuff for, for six days a week and I've been doing that for four years. So that, that can definitely be a reason why, you know, why, why every streamer is becoming bald in a way. Okay, we're getting close now. It's like 13 minutes left. Oh, nice event. Noise. Come on, more more events. Give me more. I, I need to fix my uh, stereo because like it is kind of glitching a little bit. Really annoying. It's like sometimes I can only hear from uh, from the left uh, speaker, right? Come on, come on, big event, big event. Keep on spawning. Keep on spawning forever. 
huge event. Come on. Uh, quick question, you're doing seasonal VUSA, should I level it to 61 and then graduate, or should I do anything else? Uh, make sure that you get like all of the seasonal reward. Uh, so you have that seasonal reward uh, tab up in the corner, right? And, and then you also want to make sure that you have all of the seasonal seals. Uh, so if you go into like uh, manage currency, that there is a little tab up here too, manage currency right there. Uh, you, you can trade in like season uh, seal for reward so you, you want to make sure that you got all of those i don't know i don't know if you have to do something or whatever but uh, just make sure that you claim all of the season reward and and, and then i i would urge you to just like graduate asap because you you get that pen black star tet black star the uh, the amount of like power that that you get for free is is definitely worth it But yeah, it's always up to you if you want to stick around on season a little bit longer or... It's just nowadays there is no reason to do it. There's no reason to stick around anymore. Yeah, that was a good event right there. Hopefully we get another one. You got four season tickets to use? Nice, yeah. I uh, I think I, I made one season character just because I needed to make a beginner's guide playthrough. Um... But I, I kind of had to like put that on a little bit of a break because we, we've been popping up uh, so much in the stream lately that I, I don't really have time to do that. Uh, but yeah, some someday we, we're going to get it done and it's, it's going to be a good guide, uh, free part uh, series. That was another question. You don't know um, if you're going back to your LAN or not. Um, she's 59. The armor gear can transfer. The black star is better to pick uh, main. Yeah, I picked the main uh, main hand car uh, main hand weapon black star. Uh, get get the Tet one on the awakening. Uh, pen one main hand. Yeah. Usually you end up playing the the succession anyway, so it's, it's even more better if you play the succession, but even if you end up playing Awakening, it is still like a little bit better. Is the cup event finishing tomorrow? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. We can, we can take a look on that uh, soon. A lot of seasonal guides are out of date, uh, they speak a lot of stones that don't drop anymore, the quests that don't exist. Uh, yeah, yeah. I mean, uh, that's one of, the, uh, one of the things that's gonna happen naturally with time is that uh, some of the guides are gonna go out of date and... It can, it can still be worth uh, checking on the guide, but... Um, not knowing that a few things won't be around anymore or will be changed. That that's just an expectation that you have to do, right? 
Uh, but there, there can be other things like other information that could be good for you to, to know about. But yeah, it, it does depend on the guide. Nice, another event. Perfect. Perfect. And the cup event, I won't be able to get uh, one, unfortunately. It takes a lot of hours grinding. I don't have that time. Uh, maybe uh, you should make it easy. Maybe they should make it easier. Um, I mean, it's, it's going to be saved until next time. So the, the cup event is always going to be a returning event. We, we just had a cup event maybe, may, maybe five, six weeks ago. So if, if you can't get it this time because you might be a little bit busy at work or busy at school or something, you, you can't really do more grind, it's going to save up, like it's going to stack up, right? You, you can also like transfer them into, uh, into the shard. And if you get the shard, if you can grind a little bit, it's going to be easier for you to make a cup, right? If, if you don't want to make a cup, you can just buy a cup. Usually when we have uh, item uh, events like this, it's like the cups become very cheap. Because a, a lot of people are going to make them, right? Uh, so I, I don't necessarily believe that they have to like make it easier. Because you, you could buy them. It's going to be cheaper for you. You, you can save them for next time. Uh, it's, it's like bonus money if you look at it. You know, like you, you get bonus money. Um, so yeah, I, I don't think they have to make it easier. But, but you know, different ways of looking at it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, so it's a returning event. Um, they, 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 they get saved, you know. You, you don't even need to turn them into uh, to shard if you don't want to. Yeah, this is great. Keep on spawning. Two more minutes. Let's go. Now. I, I think if you forget to kill like two of them, uh, they, they don't do like a full respawn. So we'll we see whenever we get back to that, to that, to the other pack right there. You just try LAN at the crypt and got destroyed, uh, so I'm using Awakening Witch. <laughs> yeah, the, the LAN is very squishy. Very squishy. 
you you have to play a little bit differently if you play land because uh, you don't want to get hit at all so uh, you know uh, perfect positioning like not not too close not too far away ah uh, yeah it doesn't it doesn't spawn ah Yeah, it can it can be a little bit tricky to play LAN if you don't have enough gear. Uh, but e even if you have gear, you might even die many times. Okay, this is the last pack right there. Okay, cool. Let let's go see how much uh, loot. I, I think I got like one one more event than I than I should have had. So a, a little bit lucky. Not not like, you know, just want one more event than we should have had. Could could have definitely been more lucky. But um it is also like three hundred seventy percent drop rate, so I, I do wonder how close we get to that like twenty I think I think it is like twenty two. Oh, twenty four. Okay. <laughs> 